Hello there. So this is Dr. Moore speaking, and I'm going to introduce you to uh, Music Theory 101. We're going to go over the syllabus, and I'm going to describe the assignments to you that will constitute your grade in this class. Okay. So first thing is, uh, you will need a couple of things for this class. You will definitely need Canvas access, which if you're seeing this, I think I'm going to assume that you already have it. Uh, let me pull up my syllabus here real quick. Okay, so here in Canvas, uh, you can actually see, click on syllabus here, we're going to talk about this. Um, I'm not going to read all of this to you because uh, I know you can read it and I want you to be familiar with the syllabus itself. Uh, no prior knowledge is needed to, to take this class. This is for first semester or third semester music majors. And this syllabus will tell you everything you need to know. First of all, that this is the virtual version of this class. Uh, here are the things that we will be learning over the course of the semester. I will uh, let you read those. That's basically a course activities. We'll get to those in the assignments. First of all, very important, here's my contact information. My name is Dr. Ed Morse. Uh, the way you need to contact me is through Canvas, okay? Through the Canvas Messenger app. Uh, the side right here where I have a little two there, my inbox, okay? Please do that. Um, if for some reason I don't reply within 12 to 24 hours, uh, I want you to email me at edward.morse at mbsu.edu, okay? Also, this is how you're going to set up your office hours here. It says virtual by appointment. So I want you to send me a message and we will meet, okay, uh, with Zoom or some other app of your choice, okay? All right, three things that you need for this class. You are going to need a laptop or a tablet with a microphone and a high-speed internet connection. I cannot under, uh, understate I cannot overstate the importance of having a high quality internet connection, okay? I have designed most of these exercises where you can do them with just your phone, except for the worksheets, uh, but it is definitely ideal if you can uh, do Musician and Aurelia, the two computer programs with a laptop. All right, second thing you're gonna need, uh, since the Valley is buying you the computer programs, I'm expecting you to buy uh, Berkeley Music Theory, book one, uh, published by Berkeley Press, Hal Leonard, uh, 2005. It is about $22.50 on Amazon. Considering last time we had people buy theory books, it was about $180. I, I have no guilt doing that whatsoever. Uh, okay, so Canvas, Aurelia will give you, Musician will give you later. There's the grading scale, okay? Now, here are brief, briefly the six groups of assignments. There's going to be worksheets from the music theory book one and also other stuff uh, that I make uh, in a syllabus quiz. That's going to be 20% of your final grade. Those are submitted at Canvas. Okay. Music theory level one, musician six, that is a uh, computer program we'll talk about in the second and third week of class. That's 20% of your final grade is finishing that. And uh, same thing with Aurelia six, ear training level one. Okay, two weeks of the year or two weeks of the semester, we are going to do drills. Um, there are just certain things that are very important uh, about music theory, and that is like knowing your key signatures, knowing your rhythms, knowing how to construct a scale, knowing your intervals. Okay, and these very important skills I have designed drills for. Uh, memorization is important on these. On these. You'll take a midterm exam in Canvas that is 10% of your final grade, and then you will take a final exam in Canvas for 20% of your final grade. So briefly, I'm going to go over uh, what you need to be doing with your worksheets. Okay, the very first thing is the Berkeley Music Theory and other worksheets. Uh, these are the bread and butter of how I'm going to teach you the material. Um, what you're going to do is go to an, uh, an assignment, okay, go to your assignment section in Canvas, and you are, well, we might do that at the end, uh, and I'll show you exactly how to get into it. Uh, you're going to click on assignment or module and then assignment. Uh, we're going to start with module one. 
and you're going to watch my tutorial videos and I'm going to give you a tutorial video over every chapter of the book. Okay. Right now I just finished doing the first chapter um, uh, less. I think they call them lessons. And what you're going to do is you're going to get to the end of every three chapters. There is going to be a worksheet for you to complete. Uh, and the way you're going to submit it is to take a picture with your phone. Please, not a blurry picture, or I will not give you a credit for it. And then you're going to submit it under the assignments by uploading it to me. They're going to be all graded out of 10 points. And all of them together, I don't know how many there will be yet, will be 20% of your final grade. Okay. Now, next thing, we are going to go, and in the second and third week, we're going to begin doing Musician 6. And that is a cloud music theory a course that you can take on your phone, you can take it on a laptop, you can take it on your iPad, whatever you have. Uh, it needs a microphone, obviously, and you're going to uh, reinforce the concepts that I teach you in the worksheets. Okay, you can take the course as many times as you'd like, okay? And at the end of module 12, I'm going to take your high score, and that's going to be 20% of your final grade. So that's uh, 375 points possible in level one. If you get 375 out of 375, I am going to give you uh, an A, okay? You, you get, you're gonna an A, I'll put that in, that's gonna be 20% of your grade, okay? Very similar, you're going to do the Aurelia ear training level one. I'm gonna have a worksheet on how to log in and everything like that. Um, same thing, as soon as we get to module 12, I'll take your grade on that. And that's what you're going to get uh, for 20% of your final grade. There's 182 possible points in that. Some of you are going to fly through that. Some of you, it will take time. And what it's doing is it's finding what you cannot do yet. Okay. And that also lets me know where I need to direct my teaching. Okay. You know, if everybody knows the notes of the treble clef, we're not going to spend a lot of time on that. But um, I, it, it, that's basically what it's going to tell me. There are your drills there. We talked about those. I'm still developing those. The two weeks are going to be week uh, module 7 and 13, and they're going to be in Canvas, if at all possible, okay? They are worth 10% of your grade, and there's six of them. The midterm is going to cover everything from the beginning of the class to midterm, and it'll be... Uh, one, uh, it'll be open for one hour and there's probably going to be 50 or more questions on it. So what that should tell you is that it's going to require a lot of memorization to fly through those questions that can be memorized like a key signature or something. There will not be time to figure that stuff out. Okay. And then the final will be very much the same thing, except it'll cover from the beginning, of course, to the end. It is totally comprehensive. So everything we've talked about will be on the final exam. Okay, I might give you a study guide for that if I think that the class is going well. It's going to be scored out of 100 points, just like the midterm. Okay, if you have anything, uh, special needs accommodations, please let me know. Uh, this would be something you have on file um, if you need extra time, anything like that. Completely anonymous, please message me about that. Okay, this one right here is no cheaty cheaty. Please do not cheat on my class. If you cheat on my class, I will prosecute you to the full extent of the law, okay? A lot of this stuff, you cannot skip. You have got to build on everything. Last thing, probably the second most important thing other than contacting me, this gives you a, uh, an idea of what uh, the modules and what we'll be working on and what concepts we'll be working on all the way through module uh, 14, the final exam, okay? So the last thing we need to cover here is just how to access all this stuff. And then I'll give you a brief, um, you're going to go to your classes, obviously, and this is obviously the teacher view. So um, we're going to go to there. And what you're going to see is this. You're going to see this. There's about your instructor, a little bit about me. Um, here's my contact information. Down here at the bottom of the main page, you got my faculty page if you want to listen to me play or talk. And you've got my downloadable syllabus right here. And you've got a little bit of the book. So I'll give you about a week to go and get the book. Okay. Last thing, just finishing up here is, let me go ahead and uh, stop sharing my screen here. Okay. Last thing. 
I understand a lot of you, most of you, all of you are freshmen and this might be the first time you've ever taken a music theory course. I'm here for you, okay? You're gonna find that I'm a pretty hard teacher, but you're also going to see that I'm very fair and I'm going to bend over backwards to help you learn something. If you do not know something we're talking about, I want you to definitely ask the question so others know. And then also, if I'm saying something that doesn't make sense, tell me and I will explain it to you a different way or I will come up with a new way to explain it to you. This is one of those classes. It's gonna tell me, hey, this person's serious about being a music major or hey, this person's not serious about being a music major. Okay, so with that, I'm gonna conclude this. Um, that's the basically the, the major part of your course. If you need anything, contact me via Canvas. Thank you.